And what is up everyone, it's the All Gaming Blog here bringing you some Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. Now it's this gameplay is going to be a combination of two games, one is just a kill confirmed, the other one is going to be a uh, infected. Now I didn't have enough time, uh, it, they're both relatively short, that's why I had to combine them to make a longer video for you guys to see. Uh, nevertheless, let's go to the video topic. Now in this video topic I want to talk about Xbox 720 possible delay. Um, yes, reports right now are, as of, this might change, but as of right now, Xbox 720 might have a possible delay due to overwhelming demand. Now what does this mean is, there are some issues right now with the manufacturer of the Xbox 720 because the, according to what they said in some of the and some of the reports was that there's an open chip that is very very low on that's being manufactured it's dangerously low the manufacture of this chip that they're going to use on the new Xbox and that's basically what the problem with it is that Xbox is going to rely a lot on that chip and they just don't have as many as they probably want to because Hardcore, you know, gamers, hardcore fans want Xbox 720 so much that it, it's just uh, not going to be possible to please everyone at the same time. So there's probably going to be a delay due to production issues, and I say probably because things might change. You know, we might get it earlier rather than late, but we never know. The expected launch was supposed to be on the kind of on the end of 2013. But because this delay now, it's expected to become on the spring of 2014. That's kind of a bit of a high delay there. And I think if this delay goes through, I think Xbox will be the latest on the race for the next gen consoles. Uh, no, don't despair though, because until then we're still gonna have consoles coming out throughout these next three years. Now the Wii U is gonna come out this year. Uh, somewhere as soon as November. We don't know yet. It's just rumors. It's going to be announced uh, pretty soon. I think next month, the 15th of October. Uh, the um, Nintendo is going to hold a press conference on. This is a um, infected gameplay now. Uh, Nintendo is going to hold a press conference on New York where they will be announcing how much the Wii U is going to cost and when it's going to be available to buy. So we're going to have the EU this year. The PS4 is still expected to come out on 2013 and the kind of ends of 2013, mid ends of 2013. So we're going to have a console next year and obviously the Xbox 720 to come out on 2014. Kind of uh, the beginnings, middles of 2014 with this delay. I don't know, it still might be coming early, it still might be coming late. It all depends on what happens next. Now. There's also some rumors that there's going to be a new uh, Valve is working on a new kind of console slash computer kind of type of deal coming out soonish rather than later. I don't know when it's going to come out. I don't know what's going to have. But there were some rumors that Valve is developing a uh, a new kind of console where you can upgrade, you know, the where you can upgrade like the, the components on it to make it like better because if you really think about it this uh, uh, like PS3 now and Xbox 360 have five years and in five years a lot changes uh, graphics wise you know just powerful wise it changes the, they're too outdated now compared to a computer so Valve is trying to counteract that by making a console or so we're told um, right now nothing is set in stone it's just rumors most likely but it's looking that way how will that work? Well, I don't know. That's a, probably a topic for another video. But I don't know. I think it will work good. We're going to have that to look forward to. So we're still going to have consoles. However, they're just going to take a little bit longer than they probably uh, could have. Nevertheless, we'll be seeing them. In, we always have PC games, you know. I'm starting to think more, or I'm starting to see it more as. I'd rather just go to a PC and upgrade my PC as I go and get the latest games and with the latest graphics with less issues than going on a console and just basically being stuck with a five-year-old console that doesn't have as many graphics as I would like and there's tons of issues with it. 
I don't know, that's just me. I would rather, I'm starting to go at the point that I would rather much invest in a gaming computer than buying another console every five years. But that's just my opinion. Nevertheless, this is it for this video, guys. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Give it a like if you liked the video. And uh, as always, subscribe if you want to see more and if you're not already. And that's it for this video. And thanks a lot for watching, I guess. That was a kind of weird final kill cam. But I got it nevertheless. And that was a good KDR as well, 61. Oh, wasn't too bad. So yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Peace.